Yo, drag racing fan, Lee Craft here, the Monday Morning Racer, and I was recently down at Beaver Springs, Pennsylvania, at Beaver Springs Dragway for some Friday night drag racing action. So up next in this installment of Monday Morning Racer on location, you're going to see their insane eight for cars and motorcycles, basically a top eight type of racing, some comp eliminator with a nostalgia scene to it, and peppered throughout other scenes of the racing that night. Make sure you stay throughout the video. You're going to hear from the winners of several classes on this installment of the Monday Morning Racer on location. This is Dragging at the Beaver. Until next time, God bless and keep the pedal to the metal.
Super Stock and Junior Stock, please make your way in the lane. Monday morning racer caught up with Ben Mockamer. He's in old school rail first. Before we talk about your night, tell me about what you're in, where you found it, its history, and why you're running something that's so old school. Because well, we've always run Hemi's in my family. We found the chassis in Georgia. It's a 74, uh, either old comp or limited car from the early mid 70s. Uh, we updated the cat chassis. We, we always run Hemi's, so we had it under the bench. So we figured we'd throw it all together. and It's, it's kind of or first season with the car, so we're trying to feel it out as we go. Awesome. Well, in the first season, come out here to Beaver Springs Dragway and Comp Eliminator and get a win. Tell me about the night. Oh, it's been a great night. I had to kind of go off for my time trials because we're still trying to figure the car out, figure the tune-up, but we ended up guessing right with the uh, with the dial-in and with the uh, tune-up. So. 
paid off in the end. Awesome. Look, Ben, thank you. Appreciate the time, and hopefully you'll see you in Victory Lane again soon. Sure you will. Thank you. Appreciate thank it. you. Monday morning racer effectively in victory lane. Now, I'm not the winner, but Justin Deal here is the winner, and you won in the Insane 8 motorcycle class. So, Justin, tell us, what was the night like for you on the bike? It was a very good night, of course. You know, I won. Um, just got faster every race, every run. Worked good. Awesome. So what kind of bike are you on? What's your setup? It's uh, GSXR 1000 2007, uh, extended wheelbase, uh, just trying to make it go fast, all motor. Awesome. So you came out here to Beaver Springs, the Beaver. Tell me, why should any other competitor, especially someone on a motorcycle, come to this track and race it out? That's an awesome track. The owner, uh, die hard, you know, takes care of it. Great, just great track, good group of people to race here. Awesome. Justin, congratulations. Hope you're in victory lane soon. Thank you. Monday morning racer caught up with Andy Jensen here. He won in the Insane 8. That's what they call it here at Beaver Springs Dragway. A lot of other places know it as the Top 8. Andy, look, before we talk about your night, you have got one killer Nova. Talk to me about this car you've got. Thank you. It's a, it's a street-driven car, a 1966 Nova, dual fuel, turbocharged, big block Chevrolet, runs on gasoline on the street and alcohol on the racetrack. Uh, Coker chassis, Jensen powered. It's a my girlfriend and I worked in this thing, hard to get it ready. A couple year project now, but it's done and uh, it's going pretty fast. We're happy with it. Awesome. It's beautiful and I think it, as of right now, it's the most powerful car I have stood behind. You could feel it unlike any other car I have so far. It's got some smoke. It makes about 2,800 horsepower. Actually, it's in uh, the May, May issue of RPM Magazine. It's on the cover then. So if anybody wants to get a little, little closer pictures of the car, they can check out the May issue of RPM and check it out. All right. So Andy, talk to me in particular about going round to round to the final round and winning. Winning. How was the night? It was, it was actually kind of a challenge. You know, I came here with a lot of power in the car. Planning on going fast, and I just couldn't hook it up. I think my tires were getting wore out. The track was pretty good, and my tires are kind of old, so it just wasn't working out. So, as the night went, I started taking power away and doing bigger burnouts to get some more heat in those old ass tires. And before you know it, we had a pretty fast race car. We did pretty well. Awesome. So. Andy Jensen, the winner in Insane Eight here at Beaver Springs Dragway. Thank you, Andy. Drag racing!